The cosmic calendar is a way for us to grasp the vastness of time. We've taken all of time from the birth of the universe to this very moment and compressed it into a single calendar year. On this scale, every month represents a little more than a billion years. Every day represents nearly 40 million years. Our own story begins with all the other life on our little world. Every living thing on Earth is descended from a single origin. It happened in the deep ocean darkness on September 15th, about four billion years ago. Within this tiny single-celled organism was a kind of chemical ladder, the DNA double helix. Star stuff. Oxygen, carbon, nitrogen, Elements cooked in the hearts of distant stars combined with hydrogen from the Big Bang to become alive on this little world. Through random changes, mutations in the genes, some of which led to more successful life forms, what we call evolution by natural selection, the latter grew, adding more and more rungs. It took another three billion years for life to evolve the complexity of the plants and animals that you could see with the naked eye. If the cosmic calendar had holidays, surely December 26th would be one of them. Sometime on this day, about 200 million years ago, the first mammals evolved. They brought a new feature to life on Earth, the neocortex. Back in the Triassic, the odds were against her kind. But the dinosaurs that terrorized the mammals went extinct. It was the evolution of the neocortex in small, furtive creatures such as this one that enabled their descendants to take over the planet. Mammals brought something else that was new. They suckled their young. They nurtured them. And there was love. Mother's Day on the cosmic calendar. Evolution by natural selection means that those living things able to better adapt to their environment are more likely to survive and leave offspring. Intelligence can be a huge selective advantage. The fate of this planet was changed forever by an event involving just 13 atoms. How small is 13 atoms? It's a quadrillionth the size of a grain of salt. A mutation occurred in the DNA of just one of our ancestors. Every source of self-esteem, everything we've learned and built, might come down to nothing more than this. One base pair of a single gene, just a single rung, programmed the neocortex to grow larger still and fold more deeply. Maybe it was a random zap from a cosmic ray, or a simple error in transmission from one cell to another. Whatever it was, it led to a change in our species that would ultimately affect every other species of life on Earth. It happened late on New Year's Eve on this cosmic calendar of ours. To think that, for good or evil, our ability to feel loyalty and concern for increasingly larger groups, our obsession with certain belief systems, our capacity to imagine the future, our power to transform the world and to search the cosmos for answers. The very name we gave to our own species, Homo sapiens, Latin for wise persons, all of it comes down to nothing more than a single rung on our tiny DNA ladder to the stars. <laughs>